We're here with uh, Tom Lehman and Tom, uh, something near and dear to your heart was in town last night, the third jug. Uh, Zach Johnson was inducted in the Iowa Golf Hall of Fame and had the jug with him. He told a story uh, that apparently you have to think somehow got Bennett, your daughter's Bennett, and you had to take it to a silversmith in Milwaukee. Does that sound Something right? like that. He got sent somewhere. Okay, because yeah. he, his agent had the same thing happened, he took it in. Okay, so I fixed this before. He said, you did? He says, yeah. Tom Lehman brought it in. Yeah, it's well, yeah, it's, it is a small world. But, but good for him for, you know, that, that uh, recognition. And, you know, what, a, what, a, what a fine player and what an amazing game to He also talked about you, uh, you know, being on your 2006 team in Ireland. The shot, he considers it the best shot of his career, actually. The 16th hole, he and Chad Campbell, two down, three to go. He had three wood over the river, Liffey there, and... Uh, Trying to decide where to lay up, and you said, "Gentlemen, what's the question?" You came up and, "Gentlemen, what's the question?" We're dead, you know, we're down two. Yeah. You get three wood on the green, and they end up having the hole. So yeah, yeah. You were you were part of a big part of his life. Yeah. He thought the, the world he was a captain. Well, I, I appreciate that. You know, and the, yeah, you get a great three wood there. Then the next hole, you almost hold a, a nine iron or a wedge on 17. You know, tap in birdie. But you know, he's a tough competitor, boy. I tell you what, he uh, uh, you know, he's the kind of guy that if if there were a highly Stressful situation, you know, with all the pressure in the world, you know, would you want to be in that spot? Uh, of all the guys on the tour, I'd pick Zach. Um, your mom grew up in this town. Mm -hmm. Well, I get your her first eight years of her life over yeah. by Wayland Golf Course. Yeah. You told me once. So yeah. You thought that would have been a pretty good deal growing up by a golf course. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> well, I went by her house last year of the year before the old house she grew up in. And, you know, the neat part of town, and in that little Waveland place is a good place yeah. to. Yeah. Yeah, you, uh, I remember you were here at a clinic here out in Grimes, Iowa. It was when you were tearing up the Hogan Tour before you got back on the PGA Tour. And I always think of that because you were very humble and you could tell you thought you had something going and you proved to have something. Yeah. Well, you know, golf is all about uh, confidence. You know, it's all about believing in your game and believing in yourself. Uh, and I think most everybody who plays a game competitively uh, needs to learn how to develop that level. Learned that lesson where you can believe that. You know, there's, I think very few people who are just naturally so confident that they have it you know, automatically. Most of us have to learn it. And so you know, the process of becoming a successful player is a process of learning how to believe. Growing up in Alexandria, when the golf course there, weren't the greens in the shape of states or a something? Few were. A yeah. few were. Yeah, a few were, yeah. yeah that's kind of an interesting way to. Yeah, yeah well, it. yeah, it's, the seventh hole is in the, the, the shape of Minnesota, so uh, that's kind of their calling card. There you go. Well, it's uh, great to have you back. You've had some great finishes, and uh, hopefully you can get over the hump here and get one. I hope so. Thank you. Thanks, Tom. Yeah, I appreciate it very much.